Does your salon company have an amazing purpose and a great mission that needs to be shared through your marketing? Well, watch today's video and I'll show you exactly how to do it and how it'll drive you new clients and customers. Hey, it's Jason Never from HighPerformanceSalon.com and today's video is brought to you by Sustain Beauty Co. Sustainability is a journey we must all take together. Marketing and getting people through the door of your salon is more challenging than ever because you have a lot of competition, right? There's a salon down the street, across town, they're all competing for the exact same clients and customers. So if you have a very powerful mission as your salon company and as your brand, and maybe that has to do with sustainability, maybe it has to do with your charitable contributions, maybe there's an element of your business that you want to showcase and actually make sure that people understand it, you have to have it incorporated into every aspect of your business. So let me give you an example using the exact same type of business, hotels. We've all been to hotels before and some of you guys have seen this where it says, hey, due to water shortages, we are reducing the amount of towels that we wash in our hotel. So if you don't want us to wash your towel, leave the towel up, hang it over the shower. But if you do want it washed, please leave it on the floor and we'll take care of it for you. That's a great example of sustainability inside hotels because it's good for the guest, it's good for the environment, and it benefits everyone. But hotels have recently started to get a little bit more obnoxious with this and they said, hey, we're working on sustainability, so we're just not not going to clean your room anymore. We're not going to change your towels. We're not going to do anything because that's better for the environment. And people kind of pushed back and they were like, hey, I know that might be better for the environment, but it's not also better for me. And I know that sounds really strange to say, well, hey, it should just be better for the environment and it should work, but it has to be good for the guests. They have to feel good about it and it's got to be good for the environment at the same time. How do you merge those two things together? And that would create an amazing opportunity for you to market and keep your clients and customers happy at the same time. So how does this work inside your salon? Well, if they come in and we just find out that due to a water shortage, you are no longer going to be doing shampoos inside your salon. That would be a problem, right? If the shampoo bowls were just empty and you're like, I don't know, go rinse it out at home, figure it out, right? The problem is, is that would never work inside a salon. So what you need to do instead is use other sustainable products inside your salon. For example, maybe you would get at the shampoo bowl different pressurized heads that actually reduce the amount of water consumption. Maybe with other things inside the salon, like maybe towels, you decide if you're gonna do disposable one-time use towels or if you're gonna launder towels because you might wanna do the research and find out what's actually better for the environment, right? And then there's other things like making sure that the color waste at your back bar is not polluting and going straight into the water stream. There's actually recycling programs for the color waste that you have that'll actually make sure that it doesn't just go into the water system and actually pollute the environment. So so those are some examples of ways you can actually do that. Now here's the thing, you can't just say, hey, by the way, we're gonna charge you for this and do all these things and it's better for us, but not necessarily better for you. You wanna make sure you constantly communicate to the guests what you're doing for the environment, why you're doing it for the environment, and why it's actually still good for them. It should never reduce the guest experience when they're coming into your business. Just like the hotel example I gave earlier, it's gotta be good for the environment, and good for the guests, and ultimately, that'll be good for the salons. So if you do it properly by magnifying your mission, whether it's sustainability, maybe it's being involved in your local community, maybe it's just giving back to a charitable organization. If you take that frame and you show your clients and customers how that works, it can create a massive difference inside your salon company for the affinity that your clients and customers have towards your salon, your brand, your stylist, and ultimately, to your company. If you like this video and you wanna see more content like it, do me a favor, we have a totally free Facebook group called the Profitable Salon Under group, all you have to do is head over to Facebook, search Profitable Salon, and you will get access to our private Facebook group. And then also, if you liked it and you want to see more videos like this on YouTube, you can check out our YouTube channel. Do me a favor, have a great week, and I'll see you on another video soon.